So, you're going to make some videos, huh? Congratulations. You're going to be huge. You're going to be the next Marilyn Monroe, the next Frank Sinatra. You're going to be looking back and wondering why on earth your videos did so badly. Yep, that's right. You're going to be on stage providing quality content, hopefully, but just because you feature in your videos doesn't actually make you the star. To make content that grows followings and captivates a viewer, you need to make them the star instead. Video is all about people watching it. Without them, you're just someone talking to themselves. And to make them the heroes in this story, you need to produce content they're interested in, they seek out online to watch, and when they love it, will share it with more people. Then, when you have an audience, maybe you're a star too, but you can never forget that your videos are for your viewers first. So, here's eight free tools to use to work out the best video ideas that will make your viewers feel like celebrities, grow your following and build your brand. Firstly, we have Google Trends. A trend is when something gains popularity. So when the coronavirus hit, the video calling platform, Zoom, began to pick up a lot of search terms because it was relevant to the moment. This means it's content that goes on an upward search trend. Another example of an upward trend is TikTok. It's been increasing for months and months. If you can find the trends your viewers care about that are hot topics and of the moment, or are rising consistently month on month, then there's a chance you'll produce a video that gets a lot more interest and traction. Google Trends is the free tool to use to work this out. You simply type in the topic idea for your video and it shows you what's trending. So let's use Zoom as an example here. If we type in Zoom, you can see the massive spike in traffic when the virus disrupted the world and now the trend is slowly dipping. If you can catch the trend at the start, there's gonna be less competition and you'll get in early and dominate search, social, YouTube, you name it. You can set it to track just Google or you can change it to YouTube search trends. This is interesting because search traffic isn't dying off as fast on YouTube. So depending on where you want more traffic, you need to check both. Here is where you'll get your ideas from. So let's use Zoom as an example again. Let's type it in and make the search worldwide and scroll down to the related queries section. Amazing, a list of video tiles you could produce that would be popular with your audience no matter what platform you're using. Funny backgrounds for Zoom is a breakout topic, for example. It's hot. <laughs> the term itself is up over 4,000%. You also have other related topics, so video conference shows another spike. It looks like this is how the Spanish-speaking countries are searching for it too. So use the map to make sure your target viewers in your location are interested in your topic and potential query unless you want to appeal to the whole world. Then note down all the queries that Google Trends throws up that you could make in-demand content about. Here's the result of using this technique on our own YouTube channel for a video about Zoom video calls. We made two videos on the topic, one about using a webcam with it and one about using a digital camera. One video got 336 views and the other 18,000 in six weeks. The DSLR one, although produced to try and rank on search, got in and did this to our entire channel. So, trends are an amazing opportunity to produce content your viewers care about because there could be less competition as new situations and developments dictate the trends and your audience desires this information. You can even compare topics to see if you should be making a video on, let's say, the new iPhone or the new Galaxy, for example. But a word of caution, you should not, I repeat, not make videos about trending topics if it has nothing to do with your niche. Check it out find a trend, jot down your ideas, and then step over to number two, TubeBuddy. If you've not got the free TubeBuddy tool, then there's a link in the description to download it. TubeBuddy has a ton of features, but when it comes to working out your video ideas, access the Keyword Explorer, add your keyword, and you can see how popular a desired topic is, how hard it will be to rank, and how well optimized other videos you might compete against are. It will also suggest other keyword ideas for your videos, and if you're not on the paid version, you'll get a significantly larger list. We made a video all about upgrading to TubeBuddy, which you'll see at an end screen later on. TubeBuddy gives YouTube specific data, so it's amazing if you want to get more views on the platform too. You can still use it to gauge the popularity of content, even if your focus is mainly on, let's say, building an email list. What's popular on the world's second largest search engine should translate to most other platforms, should. Combine this with Google Trends and hitting that like button, and you should be able to spot winners and then work out exactly the best title to appeal to your viewers. Number three, hit the like button. Number three, Uber suggests this is a platform for gathering more data from search. You can type in an idea and it will provide you with the number of searches per month, how competitive the search term is, and how difficult it is to rank for keyword ideas that are relevant to this topic. 
If you give them your email, you'll also see the search terms over a year, which is like a mini Google trend. But it goes deeper, much deeper. Let's use Zoom as an example again. You can now see the huge spike, but also how people clicked on content about the video calling software. So the majority came from organic search here. Another incredibly useful feature is you can see the age range for the people who searched for it. So in this case, it was mainly 35 to 44 year olds. If actually target his age group, then you're in luck. Things like referencing TV shows and music they'll have grown up with in your content will really make them feel like a superstar. They'll bond with you. But it doesn't stop here. Uber Suggest gives you questions people use on related topics, suggestions, and comparison topics. For example, Google versus Zoom Hangouts. These versus topics are usually quite popular search terms and are great for video ideas. It also shows you the top ranking websites for the term, so you can take a look at what else people have produced on the topic and plan your videos to be more detailed than theirs or more current. Oh, and if you thought this was of no use because you only care about making videos for social media, then have no fear. You can see how often these websites are shared too. With these first three tools, you should be able to generate enough in-demand video topics for the rest of your life. Now, let's move on to some other free tools to use if you're focused on getting more social media views of your videos. Number four, hashtags. Social media can give you some clues as to how popular a topic it is. Search hashtags on Twitter, Instagram, LinkedIn, TikTok, Facebook, and check out the conversations people are having and how many hashtags there are for the topic. Are there lots of questions being asked and answered? Is your topic popping up a lot? Hashtagify is a tool you can type your idea into and it will show you this information. To get results from these on most platforms, you don't want to target the most popular, but the most relevant. So when you've worked out the search interest, find the hashtags that are most targeted to it, as well as the ones with larger volumes of search and include a mixture in your final post. Number five, comments. Search for your idea on YouTube and then check out the comments on the most popular videos. You'll find people will ask lots of questions here, which will allow you to fill in the blanks that the creator might have missed out. Sometimes you'll find the same question being asked over and over again. You can make a whole video just answering this to make super relevant, highly engaging video gold. You can do this on Facebook, Instagram, or any platform with a search option too. Number six, Quora. Quora's like Google, but instead of being shown web pages made for a ton of people, individuals answer the questions that you ask. Sign up to the platform, search for the questions people are already asking about your potential video idea. It will throw up a ton of questions people have already written down, you can note down the most common ones and make videos on these or just add answers to your main video. It allows you to beef up your content and make videos people really want. Here's a sneak tip, when you've made your YouTube video, you can then go back and post it as an answer and help those people out without knowing it who have helped you. Number seven, suggested search. It's one you hear a lot, but you type your idea into Google and YouTube and you'll see the most popular searches for your idea, which might get your brainwaves ticking. Number eight, polls. Let's assume you've built or are building a following of the right people. One super way to get more ideas is to let them decide on what you make. If you have over a thousand subscribers, you can put out polls on your YouTube community board, allowing your viewers to vote on video ideas they want to see. You can also do polls in Instagram stories or even just email one to your list. Asking your viewers what they want and then making it for them means you're listening and they'll appreciate that. You can then make the video on the winning topic and post it back on your community board so all of those people who wanted to see it are likely to be highly engaged, come in and watch it straight away. Your video topics are so important. Sure, it's pretty much impossible to have every video you produce blow up, but putting the time and effort into this will help you build a following who genuinely value you. If you hit the like and subscribe button, those chances of you getting better results will increase significantly as we release three videos a week to help you master promotion and production. If you want to learn more about TubeBuddy, then check out this video here, or watch this video that will teach you how to turn a video idea into one that ranks and delivers thousands of views.